Clyde Mellon, you're a 4-H wood science leader. What is wood science doing at the favorite food contest? It would make you think, wouldn't it? Make it you would. Think twice. Well, we take advantage of this event, the, uh, the favorite foods, to, uh, to have entertainment uh, while the kids are not, not in there with their food. And um, it's a good time for the kids to, to learn about wood judging. Wood judging. So tell me about wood judging. What is wood judging about? Well, wood science judging is... Wood all, science the tool, all, all the tools that are that pertain to woodworking and safe practices, uh, safe tool usage, uh, wood identification, wood joint identification, uh, generally everything that has to do with woodworking. I see. And the children have to, if they decide to be part of the wood science judging contest, they would have to know what all these things are? Well, they, they should learn all of them. Um, they're not all on the test, but like any test, if you, if you pretty much know all the, the, the uh, questions, or excuse me, all the tools and the wood joints and such, um, you'll be better off taking the test. And we see a young lady here at the table. Do boys and girls uh, participate in wood science? Yes, ma'am. They do. Wonderful. Are you going to try it? You are. So you must be studying, huh? Well, good luck to you. <laughs> Thank you, Clyde. Thank you. You're at the Favorite Foods Contest, and I noticed there's a lot of sewing apparatus here, patterns and fabrics and tools, and I've I run into Becky Artby. Tell me, what is this about? Well, when you're here at the Favorite Foods to learn about one thing, you can learn about many different other things, such as sewing, patterns, and other tools. Now, is this for a sewing project or for a something else? It's for the judging contest. The judging, what is the judging the contest? The sewing judging contest. They'll come to the clothing and textile work or contest. And then they'll also learn the tools and the pattern pieces and how to judge clothes. So a 4 h -er has to know what all these tools yes. are called and what they're used and for. What they're used for. And they have to know what the different kinds of patterns, different kinds and the different parts of the patterns, the errors. Yes. And then what's over here? What are, what would a 4 H be judging here, Becca? You want to tell me or Becky? Um, over here, like with the skirts, you're basically seeing have they like finished the edges right, like hemming, how they put a zipper in, their buttons, and the overall like view of it. Yeah. So if you see four skirts and they're numbered, one is probably the best one and the one is probably the worst one. You've got to just rank them then. Yep. Wow. <laughs> well, that's very interesting. Thank you very much. This is clothing and textile judging at the Favorite Foods Contest. Who would have ever thought?